Hey, hey, Mama Selena for African Daisy. And I just want to say thank you so much for all of you who have subscribed to my channel. I so, so appreciate it. Uh, I also wanted to say good morning to you, wherever you are in the world. <laughs> want to say good morning. This beautiful, beautiful fall morning. It's a little bit, it's, it's actually not that cool. It's a little bit cool this morning. It's a little tiny breeze going. And of course you can see the beautiful sunshine poking through the trees there. <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to say, yeah, good morning and uh, hope you're having a fabulous day. And I just wanted to encourage you this morning. Uh, we were planning to go back out on the road. We've been home for a few days. We were planning to go back out on the road and uh, something came up. So we were like, well, let's take care of this right away. And you know, since we're home. <laughs> so I just want to encourage those of you out there. Um, well, and I just want to say one of the things that our goal, uh, my goal or the goal in me driving truck from the very beginning, for those of you uh, that have watched my videos before, I drive truck with my husband, uh, we drive a semi truck. And um, the goal in me driving was to help pay off our debt, right? So we wanted to pay our house. We built our house um, in 2020 and then um, then we had to pay it off. So <laughs> so anyway, uh, it was it was uh, we so we did that. We're debt free. Hallelujah. <laughs> and let me just tell you it's so worth it. It's so worth it. Um, no matter where you are in your what you're doing in life. <laughs> it's so worth being debt free. So I just wanna encourage you in that to pursue that because um, yeah, it, it will go better for you at the end of, at the end. <laughs> the other thing is what happens in that situation is like right now, although we'd like to go back on the road um, and make money, um, we also know that we can, we can stop now and we can take a break and we're not, because we're not living paycheck to paycheck. Um, so I just wanna encourage you, uh, if that is you, you are living paycheck to paycheck, you just can't seem to get out of the cycle, you know, just to get some help uh, because it's so worth it. <laughs> it's so worth it. We're not taught how to handle finances in this country, uh, in school either. It's, you're taught math and, you're taught math, you know, adding, subtracting, dividing and all that, but really you're not taught how to handle finances. So, so anyway, learn and, and all that so that uh, you can, you know, live a good, a good life <laughs> so that you can just not be taken out by uh, things that come your way. I just want to show you the beautiful, beautiful outside here. It's looking, looking gorgeous, looking gorgeous out here. So anyway, so I encourage you in that. And uh, so anyway, yeah, because it makes life so wonderful <laughs> to be able to just know that, you know, um, the house is paid, you know, so we don't have to worry about that. And the, this is taken care of. The other thing I want to encourage you with, and I got to set my coffee down because, well, I got it. <laughs> I got my hands are. So the other thing I want to encourage you with is um, the cats are trying to drink my coffee. Way. Um, <laughs> so the other thing I want to encourage you <laughs> is a lot of times I hear people say, okay, we drive truck and I believe trucking has phenomenal money in it. It really just does. Um, but I hear a lot of truck, oh, 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 it's no good money. Oh, it's bad money. Oh, <laughs> and that annoys the heck out of me for a lot of reasons. Um, but I just wanted to encourage you, uh, no matter what job you do, <laughs> I hear a lot of people say, oh, you know, they, they, okay. So trucking is the thing. What, 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 you know, what job do you feel like has good money? Okay. Now they want to, you know, I don't know. I'm not sure what the, I heard somebody was making like 10, $15 at 
at uh, McDonald's. I don't know what the going rate is. I have no idea. But if you're making that much money at McDonald's, you should not be complaining about the pay. You should be working hard, <laughs> making as much money as you can. Cause, uh, but anyway, uh, the reality is this. The more money you make, right? Um, uh, the more no the, the reality is, is this well you, the reality is this if, if the any job that you do when you make money the way you make money okay is not necessarily oh because I have this job okay the job provides the money right but how you yourself make money or or succeed in life is how you handle that money that you make so it doesn't matter how much money you um how much money you're getting from your job i remember when um we first started out before we had selena my husband was working a job that was seven dollars an hour okay that was a few years ago yeah seven dollars an hour do you know in that time we paid rent we bought land uh, now, the thing that suffered the most during that time was probably our food budget, which, uh, you know, right now we could, you know, I could handle to cut back on my food budget. <laughs> but um, at the time, that was probably the one thing that suffered the most. Uh, we had $40 that we used for our food budget. Well, that was kind of until, you know, he came along shopping with me one day. <laughs> but... Uh, anyway, I just wanted to encourage you to say, please, please, please get some financial help. If you can't figure out, um, like if you really feel like the only way you're going to do well is if you get a higher paying job or if you whatever. And, and it's just not true. The higher paying job is glorious and wonderful. But if you haven't worked out how to handle the, the finances you have on where you are, um, you know, and, and granted, sometimes you just do need to get 10 jobs. You know, sometimes you, you do need to work to get out of debt. And, and so sometimes you got to sacrifice a lot. So we, we did that. We sacrificed a lot. We've been sacrificing a lot to get where we are. It wasn't just, um, you know, all the bed of roses here. <laughs> And so, um, but we sacrificed a lot so that these moments, uh, it's been over a week, uh, we've been home and, um, yeah, and we're not under, you know, <laughs> like we still have money in the bank. And so anyway, just want to encourage you in that. So I'll pick up my coffee, I'm having my coffee this morning. So I just want to encourage you because the reality is everybody can do well. And I think in life, um, you know, I, I know growing up, I didn't like, um, I didn't like learning. <laughs> I didn't like school. And I realized that life is about learning and school. <laughs> it's about learning, you know, even if I'm not going to, physically going to a school, but I, I need to be learning. And so I had to learn, we had to learn about finances. We had to learn about those things. And so that's something that we're doing. And uh, so, anyway uh we love you all and we hope that you have hope that you have a glorious glorious day and i'll see you in the next one bye